Alright guys, so this is an impromptu unplanned video, so sorry that the lighting is bad. I don't want to move everything to the dining room table for the best light. I'm just doing it right here on the kitchen counter so you guys can see um, what I'm doing. So, I'm basically prepping meals for lunches, for baseball games, for snacks, pretty much anything for all six of us to be able to grab and go. Uh, majority of it is for school lunches, but like I said, if I haven't prepared something for <clears throat> a baseball game or something like that, or the kids are going over their grandma and grandpa house or whatever, I have them always take something. This is kind of what they're taking from. So um, this container, and I keep all this in the refrigerator. Um, this container here, I'm just putting all the drinks and stuff in. Uh, water bottles are not in here. It just take up too much space. We do have uh, water bottles on the refrigerator door. Thought I showed you show you guys real quick on the refrigerator door. So here is the water bottles that um, are sitting here. As you can see, uh, Daniel has several open water bottles, and the reason that I put letters on the top of the caps. Soon as, basically, as soon as I get a whole thing of case of water, I will write on top and give everybody an equal amount. And like this was probably supposed to be guessed and somebody ended up drinking it or they just didn't notice and they grabbed it. Um, this should be labeled, but usually it's either Sean or Jimmy, so um, that's probably who that is. But anyway, so the water thing, when I get a case of water in, I automatically go ahead and label them. I leave a couple uh vacant like this for if we have guests but the point of this is just so that i know who's wasting water basically um and it gives every it kind of rations out the water for people because they can refill these from the sink if they want to um but really the whole point is the kids would open up a water leave it out open up a water we had no clue who was doing that who's leaving all this water everywhere so i just came up with this simple idea to just when i get a case of water in i label it and there you have it so um it looks like sean has about three already open daniel has four jimmy has two nay has one uh Jiraiya is really good with drinking her water before she opens another one so you don't see any in here because they're probably either in her um, snack bin or they are out in the garage um, that she hasn't gotten a new one and another thing she will do is she'll transfer it into her reusable water bottle she likes to drink from that so um, yeah, that's just, I wanted to give you a quick sneak peek on um, the water bottles and them being on the refrigerator door. All right, so back to the little snack area. So like I said, drinks. And then I have the pink bin and all this stuff came pretty much from the Dollar Tree, the bins as far as them. And they're kind of small. I got a ton of these. <clears throat> so this has like popcorn, veggie straws, and some like plain potato chips down in there. Um, yeah. So that's something crunchy. This can change. It can be Chex Mix. It can be crackers. Uh, anything crunchy usually goes in there. And then we have the green one, uh, which has fruit in it. And it just has apples. It's got some grapes. Some matty looking uh, <laughs> uh, clementines that need to be eaten or tossed. And then some fruit cups. And I just keep some straw or some spoons there. Because a lot of times they'll grab that and they'll forget the spoon. So I just kind of keep it there. And then we've got this veggie one. It's got carrots and uh, pre bag stuff. Some cucumber stuff like that. And I will be going to this store in town where I can get these little plastic. Uh, small little basically like sauce containers that I can put their ranch or French or whatever they want. Peanut butter or whatever. And I'll usually have some of those in the fridge. I just don't have any today. So um, this is a big thing of salad. And this can be for, you know, if we eat it for lunch or for dinner. I usually just kind of chop up salad and put it in there. There is some egg. There is some just regular, what is that, cantaloupe. I chopped up a couple of fruit sticks. Or I'm sorry, cheese sticks and put those in there. And some shredded cheese. And then here's just an extra a bag of lettuce this is empty because I'm actually in the process of making sandwiches and what I would do is just make sandwiches the night before put them in here and then they can get whatever they want so meat sandwiches PB&J's uh, tortilla roll-ups pita 
sandwich type things, uh, flatbread, whatever I pre-make up will go in here. Um, so that's that. I haven't done it yet. Um, and then we've got just some, um, basically the uh, dairy bin. So Danimals and these, these are actually frozen. I just took them out of the deep freezer. So uh, those are the little Go-Gurts. And then we have some, just two cheese sticks. I got to get some out of the freezer and restock it. But yeah, that's kind of some of the stuff that we have in our refrigerator that we can go to for any quick thing that we're running out the door. If somebody needs a snack, it just, if I can kind of keep up with this uh, weekly, it helps a ton with when we're running out the door, going somewhere um, and we need to have food. That way we don't have to buy when we're out. So sorry, this is kind of jumbled up. It was literally last minute a thought like hey maybe I should film this while I'm working so yeah so I'm gonna get to making sandwiches for tomorrow I usually make about six half and half or I do three PB&J's or if we have the frozen PB&J's then they know they can just look in the freezer and grab those but I try to at least have maybe two or three of those two or three meat some type of tortilla roll up type of thing um, also this can have tortilla chips in it this bin sometimes and then the little cap would have sauce if they want chips and salsa for lunch um, and then if we do like our Tupperware um, where we put different stuff in there then obviously that would be like I would make that the night before or morning of it wouldn't be from all this like if we did a lunchable type thing um, but this is just basically my pre-packaged way of doing things so um, I hope this video wasn't too crazy I just wanted to share this with you guys and I have a ton of links below so you guys can check those out and I will talk to you guys in the next video bye